Hi, it's Michelle Stone with Masterpieces with Michelle. How are you? Today is April 14th, and I am going to do a little sketch from my, my 365 day drawing book. Um, so the prompt, I've been doing these since April 1st, and today's the 14th day. And so each day I do a, um, I draw a sketch in a little five by five square. And, um, and then I go by the little prompt that's right here. So today is uh, create an illustration based on the name of your street. So the name of my street is called uh, Country Place. And so I am going to, um, going to draw like a little, a little country scene. So I invite you to go ahead and grab a piece of paper and maybe some colored pencils or crayons or um, bring your children to the table or your grandchildren to the table or whoever uh, that you would like and um, go ahead and draw. So if you were to, so I'll ask you the question, if you were to create an illustration based on the name of your street, what would that look like? So, or you could do it based on the name of my street or a street that you pick. Maybe it's um, somebody else's street, your favorite friend or your grandparents or something like that. So, all right, so I went ahead and pulled out some of my colored pencils. I've got some blues and some greens. Um, I'm gonna do, I was thinking I wanted to do a nice little uh, blue cottage. So, that's what I'm going to do. I don't know if you can see it okay. Um, not going to be a big, I only have a 5 inch square, so. And I'm going to have some, just a very basic house. And I like the look of um, gray brick. So that's what I'm gonna put on here. Just something very simple. So how are you? We are in the middle of the year is 2020. So we're in the middle of the Rona and I'm doing these little sketches taking on this book because um, I want to give you something to do, some kind of reprieve that you can do with your children or with your, your um, maybe by yourself or with your friends, kind of do be a little something that, that will offer you a a moment to kind of be in the present moment. And um, I like yellow and blue together. I think it's a really cool combination. At least today anyway. So I'm drawing out like a little cobblestone walkway. And uh, and you know, when you do these little sketches, my whole thing um, that I started this year was to, the concept was, was to doodle for 20 minutes a day. And so, um, or up to 20 minutes a day. I know sometimes, sometimes it's hard, you know, you've got different things that you want to do in, in your life and, and, um, 
and you know you've got your daily life with work and and um, keeping your kids busy and or your family busy or you know whatever the case may be or maybe you just live on your own and you're still trying to figure out not figure out but you know you've got your own hobbies that you're already busy with and stuff and so and sometimes my whole thought is is that you know it's it's important to spend some time just being mindful just being conscious of of um of what's going on you know instead of being caught up in everyday life it's so easy to get caught up in watching TV or um, what other people have got going on in their life and and you know it's important to take a moment and presence I know that right now we've got the corona um, the COVID-19 pandemic and so there's lots of people all over the world who are concerned about that that's a daily concern or maybe you've got loved ones who are um, in the hospital and you can't talk to them or or go visit them or anything and so do you want something to kind of um, relax your mind for a little bit so I offer to you to join me in getting a piece of paper or even in your mind if you want to um, just start to draw like you know if you were to draw the an, an illustration based on the name of your street uh, sorry my eye is watering <laughs> um, what would that look like you know what what's the name of your street does it make any sense do you live on Hawthorne Way and if so what would that look like or do you live on um, uh, something there's I'm trying to think of different addresses off the top of my head where I live in Tampa, there's some main roads. One is called Hillsboro. So if your road were Hillsboro Avenue, what would that look like? Or if it were um, on Franklin Street, would you draw a picture of uh, Franklin Delano Roosevelt or any other Franklin that you know? Wow, my eye is really watering. <laughs> um, or would you draw a picture of um, if it were Seneca? If it were Seneca um, or Crestridge? I'm just thinking of different people that I know and their so Crestridge, and Crestridge is actually a circle. What would that look like? So this is what mine is going to look like. And I'm just going to kind of leave it like that, maybe do like a real light blue sky. <laughs> Hold on, we're about to get interrupted by my team. <laughs> so, all right. Okay. There you are. Created illustration based upon the name of your street. So I mine says Country Hills, and that's what I have. So this is my drawing for today. Um, so go ahead, remember, uh, doodle the residue of your day away. All right, thanks. Bye.